Hello, Pam is here. Um, as the as to the request of a lot of people, I'm going to be going over the Octavia build that I was running when I did my nine hour survival. Um, just really quickly, I want to preface that I was testing the Topaz shard at the time, and it essentially created a uh, invul a state of invulnerability as long as your one was uh was active because it dealt uh, blast damage. Um, and for each take a blast damage it was doing to enemies, it was giving you shields. It no longer gives you shields when your shields are broken. So don't run a topaz shard, and these shards honestly don't matter. Um, I put them on a long time ago. I guess the energy orb just kind of needed, not ne like, could be useful, but not really, because Octavia gives you energy. Um, yeah, so I was running this build here. I ran actually low strength with multi augmented and multi efficiency. Multi efficiency gave me an extra thirty six percent duration, and this gave me an extra sixty percent uh, strength. And then the growing power was an extra twenty five percent power strength. So altogether, that's an extra eighty five percent power strength, which is like what one hundred seventy percent power strength. Um, I was running adaptation at the time. Uh, I obviously want to swap it for rolling guard. It's not a good build, and you kind of don't need prime flow to be honest. You could probably swap that for like Augur Secrets or something else. Uh, the main reason why I ran this build was I really wanted to get a large range on my Octavia just for the sake of the Topaz shard at the time. And also with Octavia, you really don't need to bring any weapons. The Mallet combined with the Resonator will kill every single enemy um, that you run into. I was seeing damage procs into the 100, 100 millions. Like, I think on Corpus Enemy, I was seeing like 150 million damage procs sometimes. But, yeah, this is the build. The weapon I was running at the time was the Glaive Prime. It wasn't this build. It would, it would, it was, I was running this. So, this was my Glaive Prime build that I was running at the time. Um, and that's kind of like all I really used. I used my Glaive Prime, my Octavia, and then I also ran my Smita which is this guy. So, you know, this is my build that I ran for my Smita. Uh, for Smita, you would definitely want to have Charm, Tech Enhance, and Tech Assault are kind of musts. Momentous Bond is good for upkeep on your Smita. Um, I have Synth Fiber, I also run Mischief. Um, and yeah, some other basic mods. But that's the total build. Hope you guys have fun with it, and have a great day.